The Farmington Hills Police and Fire Departments are trying to get more women interested in careers as first responders. Today they held the first hands-on workshop that was specifically focused on young women in the high school age range. Local force Tim Pamplin shows us the event with the theme of protect, serve, and empower. Well, here come the young ladies heading to an overpass across Interstate 696. Part of the training, getting hands-on experience with a speed detector gun. The program, Red, Blue and You, is all about recruiting young ladies as first responders. To show them the great options that the Farmington Hills Police Department has to offer them for a career uh, of service to their community. There, there's a radar detector, the young ladies heading up. They're from the Farmington Hills and surrounding communities. It's a day-long camp in both the fire and police departments. I'm sure that was a honk of approval. <laughs> How was it? It was, it was fun. Top what? speed I got was 85. That's Officer Maya Jones on the right. She started out as a civilian with the department and was soon sent off to the academy. I actually just recently graduated from the academy on uh, May 18th, so I'm very fresh and new on the job, but um, so far I'm loving it. Um, it's everything that I imagined. Um, just the experience and the growth that you get from the job is great. Like I say, it's also the fire department. The chief tells me there's a big disparity between men and women as first responders. This city wants to change that. I'm very big on community policing, so I think it's very important, especially during these times right now, that you gain a relationship with the community um, because the community is, you know, who's going to have our back in the end and we need to have their back as well. It's definitely about like being there for people who didn't have anyone else there for them. A lot of people go down the wrong path and it's just because they didn't have anyone else to guide them and I want to be there to help people. Sometimes there's that stereotype where it's like, oh, a woman can't do that because they're weaker, they're smaller. You know, and I just like, I just, you can prove them wrong. You can prove anybody wrong that women are just as capable of doing as what, doing things that men can do. It's really, that's it. And oftentimes, so much more in Farmington Hills this afternoon. Tim Pamplin, Local 4. Ah, what a great message. Thank you, Tim.